Hello Twin Flames and welcome to the DM to the F reading for Tuesday. So today we're going to use the Divine Masculine's Art Truths to bring in a message. So thank you angels. What do the Masculines want to communicate to you today, Divine Feminine? What do they want you to know in their King Power? Because they are in their King Power right now. What does he want to say to you at this time? Thank you angels. So I'm taking out anything I feel is jumping out here. Here we go. So this is the most important one because it jumped out. So he's saying to you, I'm frustrated. Please don't pay attention to my moods. I allow my physical world to affect me more than it should. I get frustrated at my life and I know it needs to change. I'm working on this. So he really wants you to know it's not you, it's him. It's nothing you're doing. It's all about what he's going through. And he's saying I'm frustrated. And he gets very angry at himself. And he can sometimes take that out on you. And he can sometimes even make you feel guilty because your life's going well. Or you seem to have things together. And he's looking at his own life thinking, my life is a mess. A big hot mess. I need to change it. So he's saying, I know it needs to change. I'm working on this. So once again, he's letting you know he is doing the work. And we spoke about that earlier. You know, if things seem still on the surface... It's all going on behind the scenes. You know, there's chaos and change and upheaval about to come in. So trust in that. So please don't pay attention to your divine masculine's moods because it's his physical world that's affecting him. And that's making him feel frustrated. And that can bring with the anger and pain. I am growing up. So he's also reminding you he's still growing up on this journey. And, you know, when we realise that it's easier to forgive them... It's easier to have faith in divine timing and it's easier to just let things be because he's not going to do the things that you expect him to do in the way that you expect him to do it because he's teaching you lessons. You know, he's giving you the lesson of faith and patience and trust. So he doesn't do it your way because it's his way and that's the right way. That's okay. So the angels are saying he is growing up, believe that and feel that and know that because then we realise that when we grow up we sometimes make mistakes but those make mistakes are lessons that make us strong. And he's saying, yes I get attention from others but it does nothing for me. So you may be angry at your twin or frustrated because he seems to be getting attention elsewhere. Maybe he's flirting with others or he's online. And he's saying, I get attention from others online and in person, but he does nothing for me. So he's reminding you that he does nothing for it. He's saying all it does is boost my pride and my ego. And I'm stepping away from all of that because that's no longer important to me. So if your masculine has been a player in the past, you know, if he's cared about those things, if he's wanted to be around people that have boosted his ego or his pride or giving compliments or made him feel good he's saying I'm growing up that was the old me this is the new me those things just aren't important to me now and I'm stepping away from all of that so this is another sign that he's preparing to commit to you and you know sometimes the masculines just are online you know and that can be very frustrating for the divine feminine because you think why isn't he replying to me why isn't he making the effort with me you know, why is he liking everyone else's pictures and not mine? And sometimes the masculines behaves in that way because they feel that if they just like your photo, everyone's going to know how they truly feel about you. And they may not at that moment be ready to face that. So remember, things are not always what they seem. He's saying, I do care. I'm sorry for ignoring you and making you doubt how I feel. It was selfish of me. I care about you and I always will. So he's growing up and admitting to you that he's sorry for ignoring you. So he is admitting that he's ignored you, but he hasn't done it intentionally. And that's the truth. You know, you might think, oh, he's done it to hurt me, to get on my nerves, to get up my nose. And he's saying, I'm sorry that I made you doubt how I feel. It was selfish of me. I care about you and I always will. So he's letting you know that you matter. Honestly, I've got angel bumps. I say it and there's the card. And someone asked me how I channel the messages. And the messages come through from above. The cards just are a visual tool that help. 
you matter. So he's saying to your divine feminine, I'm frustrated because I'm growing up. And when we grow up, we go through growing pains, frustrations, aches, struggles. You know, we go through these hormones and feelings in the body, which can bring in highs and lows. And sometimes that can make us do selfish things. And he's saying, I do care about you because you matter. Our friendship matters to me. And this is about the love, but also the friendship. And the friendship is the glue that keeps the connection together. And this is the friendship, the way you can talk and share time and be partners. Our friendship matters to me. And I hope we can work on bringing that back stronger and better than it was before because I care. So he's had to grow up and make decisions to be able to bring back not only the love and the partnership, but the friendship too. Because without that, what have you got? You know, even if you come together and make love after that beautiful intimacy, without the friendship, what have you got? It's the friendship that glues it together. And he's saying, I'm processing. I'm working out what to do. I'm working out what to say. And I'm working out how to do it. That's why I need time. So he's saying to you, I need time. If I'm being quiet, I'm not intentionally ignoring you, even though you may feel that I am. You do matter to me. It may be a bit selfish right now, but I'm processing because I'm working it all out because I'm growing up and I'm leaving behind the things that don't serve me. And I am frustrated at that too, the time it's taking, but I know that I need to do it my way because that's the way I'll follow through on my plans. So the big message today, Divine Feminine, is don't get frustrated if your masculine isn't yet showing you their true self because they're growing up and processing and working it all out. But he's saying to you, you do matter to me, not just you and, you know, our intimacy, but our friendship. And I do care about that too. Your opinion matters to me. And I do get frustrated at the time things take within me and my own life. And that's what I'm sorting out. So give it time. So also a big message that, you know, when you guys come back together, you know, because you matter, it's going to be the friendship that blossoms too. And, you know, that's what holds great unions together. You know, without our friendship, me and George wouldn't be together still because it's our friendship, not just the love and the passion that holds it together. The fact that we have such a great friendship as well as everything else. Because being each other's best friends is part of the journey. Because you are best friends, united in passionate love. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.